Ryerson had a particular orientation to making change in the world that helped me not to be so afraid of taking leaps. When you're a disabled young person, people rush in to help. They just assume that you can't do anything. And as a result, so many disabled young people don't ever have an opportunity to learn how to struggle. If we want disabled folks to be independent adults, we have to create spaces where it's safe for them to fail. Because I had been exposed to such an interdisciplinary perspective at Ryerson, it made me feel that if I didn't feel satisfied with what I saw out in the world, that it was okay to go out there and dream something of my own into being. <laughs> 